In primetime news this evening, sinister plot. Jury finds Amar Collymore guilty of murdering his wife. A disappointed but not surprised, the Prime Minister breaks silence on constitutional reform saga. And the Ministry of Health dispels AstraZeneca vaccine worries. Good evening and welcome to primetime news on air and online at onespotmedia.com and a special welcome to our viewers on TVJ International in the Cayman Islands. I'm Archibald Gordon. And I'm Janella Precious with a preview of what's the coming business news. Andrea Chisholm is here. Janella, this evening we're talking about inflation for the month of April. And guess what? It's within the target range set by the central bank. Details later on in the business day. Thank you, Andrea. And Jermaine Brown has a preview of Primetime Sports. Well, thank you, Archie. Well, after a few weeks of exciting action, the finalists in the ISA T20 All-Island competition were decided today. We'll tell you who those two are a bit later on. No athletics? Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm sure they're going to have athletics. They have to. <laughs> and Romain also has a preview of the weather report and forecast. There are no major changes in the forecast for the remainder of this week. We still have dry conditions expected right across the island and we still have strong winds especially across southern parishes no comment there is also sports commentary and the prime in this newscast but before the break the feedback question and this evening we're asking do you think it is important for the government and opposition to reach consensus on constitutional reform give reasons for your answer and you can share those comments online facebook.com slash television jamaica and you can post on x at TVJ News Center. Please stay with us. Primetime News returns after this break.